Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, welcome to my channel. My name is Nan Rev Sims, and welcome to part two of my Sims 3 Perfect Genetic Leprosy Challenge. Oh my god, it's gonna take me so many, it's gonna take me so many parts to get used to saying that. Um, but if you haven't already watched part one, I'm gonna have a link, as always, in the top right and in the description so you can go catch part one first before you watch the rest. And yeah, we're just gonna get right back on into things. Miss Layla is on her way to go do a logic class. She wanted to do it, so I'm gonna let her do that. I do want to fulfill a lot of her lifetime wishes. That way we can get some lifetime reward points. I do want the one I don't know if it's base game it doesn't look like it's base game oh, there's one that's like they won't turn down like any romantic interactions so the townie is like if you flirt with a sim they won't turn it down at all um, but it doesn't look like it's base game which sucks I thought it was but maybe attractive might help this one says whether it's the pleasing scent or charm people will suddenly like you more um, so I do want to try to get that one since the other one I'm thinking of is not not available and also the fertility treatment i'm not in a rush to get that one because i'm not trying to have twins or triplets no thank you but i do want to try to get some so that it's easier for um sims to or for it's so it's easier for layla to get to know sims and i think there might be an issue back here with sims oh there's not okay because i was going to say i do have a mod in that let sims use all entry points to the building and sometimes if you don't edit the fence back here the sims will get stuck but i do see some things we can come catch for money we can donate them to she is going to go ahead and take that logic class also marty is now the father of a new baby boy <laughs> maybe that's why he was like rejecting our advances because his wife was literally about to give birth within days i believe he's at work oh he's at the park okay maybe we'll go to the park when we're done um just because she also does want to play chess so why is this girl not at school i said he was at the park where is he oh wait there's justine where's your baby sis you just gave birth why are you why are you sitting at a park right now she gave birth less than 24 hours ago She's like, girl, get out of my face. <laughs> I don't see Marty. Do you guys? Oh, he's back there. I see him. He's having a burger, maybe a hamburger. Yep, yeah, he is. Um, okay, so she's done with her class. Love that. She wants to buy a chess table. I don't think we'll do that anytime soon, but we'll just promise it until she has another promise or wish. Not. <laughs> promise we'll lock that in until she gets another wish and then we'll just take it away we could come collect some of this stuff and start a little garden for more money she does want to join the military career so i will do that as well but i do want her to come to the park and start flirting with him a bit more so we can get a child you know what i forgot what's his name he's an easy target Christopher Steele that is like my go-to sim <laughs> okay so I'm gonna have her go to the park and play chess for a little bit with Marty Keaton and then we're gonna go over to Christopher Steele's house because it's super easy to um, get into a relationship with him because he has no loyalties none whatsoever um, we're gonna play chess with where are you Marty come on down Marty all right, she caught a red admiral butterfly. Oh, that was it. She didn't catch the blue one. Wait, was he already heading over here or did we call him over here? He's like, let's play chess with my BFF. How are you starting without us? <laughs> we'll do that until her, oh, you know what? Her logic is literally about to improve. She's like, yo, my house was just updated. I stood there and everything just changed. Which, by the way, let me show you what changes I made. It wasn't much. It wasn't anything at all. <laughs> I just changed the outside colors, which I'm, prob I'm probably going to change again. Um, and then I also just changed the wallpaper in her bedroom. Let me turn on the light. And I gave her bed a little... A little update just a little bit and I put up one painting and a, and a little rug that's it 
<laughs> That's all I did. She wants to buy a logic book, sure. Why do you want to purchase everything, girl? We don't have, I mean, we have a few simoleons to spend, but I'm not trying to spend all of it. All right, let's visit the Steel household. We'll see if we can get a baby out of him today. And then once she's done with that, we're gonna head over and get, she just improved her logic skill to level three. We're gonna go ahead and go join the military career. We'll join whatever career she wants to join. I don't think I've ever played through the military career like that, but can do that. Where is he? The TV's on, but I don't see him. Where are you, Christopher? Is he actually watching the TV? Let's see, because it'll show when she gets... Oh, there he is. There he is. What are you watching that's making you clap like that? <laughs> this is so creepy, watching Sims through their house. Anyway, he'll be an easy one to get a baby out of because, again, he has no loyalties. He has no girlfriend, nothing. He'll be like, yeah, sure, I'll, I'll help you with your project. <laughs> As I said, I am pre-recording a few of these, so... Oh, are we in the house? I didn't even realize. I'm not even paying attention. She wants to make silly face. Look, she's already into this man. Not that face though. Um, we'll ask him about his career. Oh. Girl, don't be turning him down like that. Come on, let him chat with you. I don't think he has a career. Ask his sign, ask, his, ask if he's single. Yeah, he's unemployed. Um, so it's gonna be easy to get this done with him because he has no job, so he's stuck at home. We'll compliment his house and then we'll gossip. And he's a Pisces. Make silly face, tell funny story. Um, but yeah, he is unemployed. And I think that's it. I don't care what any, anyone else thinks. I think you're hot. <laughs> Um, he's single and he's a Pisces. Um, we'll talk about family even though neither of them have families. And we'll chat. And we'll tell dramatic story. It says Marty Keaton just had a little baby. Mom and baby are both perfectly fine. Hopefully Marty is prepared for the adventure that is parenthood. Girl, how are you gossiping about him? And I don't know if you see all these... Um, little notifications on the side about unrottable sim i think that has to do with the school because it looks like a majority of them are children or teenagers so i'll probably have to go in and fix that who is calling us okay let's answer phone because it could be someone important it could be martin <laughs> martin it could be marty telling us you know he loves us and if it is we're definitely going to talk to him Really? Okay, we'll, we'll take it. It's free money. Why not? I thought it was what's his name. Hey, don't sit down. Come here. Come here, dude. All right, let's continue to talk about family, chat, compliment home, consider attractiveness, gossip, even though there's not much gossip yet. Um, oh, we could just risky woohoo right off the bat, but we're not going to. I love that. I love that she can just jump right into it. <laughs> she knows what's up. She knows what's up. All right, let's skip through this. Okay, come on. Okay, he's friendly. Um, but if you guys do watch my current household, he's like the great, 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 great. I don't know how many greats grandpa of that household. Um, like, he's my go to. I don't care what anyone else thinks. I think you're hot. Oh, Layla finds that Christopher Steele is quite pleasing. Hey, sir, stop it. Wait a minute. Okay, we're gonna ask him about his gender preferences, gossip, get to know. Um, anyway, Layla finds that Christopher Steele is quite pleasing to the eye, ranks seven out of 10. So I don't know, maybe she has a type, cause Marty is like pretty, you know, he looks like he goes to the gym. He's muscular. Maybe that's her type and Christopher is not that, but. Have you heard Nick Alto and Joffrey Landgrab have become enemies? That's that's not surprising. His gender preference is undecided. Okay, good to know. Um, oh, now we can invite him over. 
Um, okay, we're just gonna keep complimenting him. Did you know that there's a new baby in the neighborhood named Tori Keaton? I've heard that it's really cute, but all babies look the same in my opinion. It's a shame they don't come with more hair. Dang, the shade. How are the Sims 3 like producers throwing shade at themselves? Because y'all know they're talking about the little burrito babies. <laughs> okay, why are you not our friend? Okay, make silly face. <gasps> there we go. Literally, there is no gossip in town. It's about this baby. Okay, we are going to use a... I want to use a flirtatious joke or pickup line, but it doesn't look like the pickup line is there. Oh, he's gonna take he's gonna take everything. We'll compliment his personality. Flirt with him. Amorous hug. We'll just see how far we can get in this part. Cross your fingers, guys, that we can get a baby. Um, once she is pregnant, I'm gonna go have her get a job because I believe you get paid time off if you're pregnant so even if she's not working we'll still be getting paid which is which is always a good thing um we will do a hold hands i could have sworn there was a pickup line there that before hey dude where are you going she wants to learn two more of his traits we don't know any of his traits actually i think we know that he's friendly where are you gonna go pee in the middle of our conversation can't you hold it look at her in the mirror back there Oh my god. <laughs> she looks so creepy. She's just standing there and now she's gonna walk into the bathroom. I don't think we can do shower woohoo, no. Yeah, that one came in late night, like I said last time. Ew, dude, you just peed and you did not wash your hands and you are holding hands with her. That's disgusting. Wash your hands, folks. Don't be like Christopher. Um, Amorous hug. Why did all of our options go away? Okay, and then we are going to... I don't want to do a first kiss because... Yeah, I don't want to do a first kiss because then they'll have the uh, cheater reputation. And my girl's not a cheater. We're just trying to complete this challenge. Um, she is not from the baby daddy challenge. If you guys remember Ezra... <laughs> He, he don't he doesn't care about that reputation but she does she doesn't want a reputation around town she's trying to keep things low-key so we'll just keep flirting with him until we get extremely irresistible there we go we got it does she want to woohoo with him she doesn't but we're gonna do it anyway propose going steady try for a baby all right I'm just gonna click on the bed though we can and choose Christopher Steele. Hopefully, cross your fingers, he does not turn us down. Come on. Oh, okay. There was a little, a little, a little lag there. <laughs> he like pulled her, but she didn't move. Um, that was awkward. Okay. Yeah. See, I knew Christopher would be down. I told y'all he has no loyalties, none whatsoever. I'm still gonna try to get Thornton Wolf. We might trap him one day. Somebody will. But yeah, let's listen in for that baby sound. Layla Curry and Christopher Steele have finally made their move and kissed. <laughs> Even though there was some accidental nose bumping, she'll always remember the first time their lips met. We love that. All right. Okay, sis, you, now's not the time to be clumsy. We have things to do, okay? Let's get it together. Let's get it together, girl. Absolutely. All right, guys. Um, by the way, I only changed her, changed her everyday outfit. I didn't change anything else. So what she's wearing is what she came with. <laughs> I couldn't be bothered. I really wanted to get this these parts out to you guys. So that's why I've been just ignoring everything and just going for it. Wow, on the first try, we've got a baby on board. We love that. Love that. All right, we're not gonna do any of that. He, he served his purpose. Oh, and he's just going straight to sleep with his eyes open. You guys, his eyes are open. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, what is happening? Why, Christopher, why? I've never had this happen to a sim. What is happening? His eyes are just open. Okay, she's gonna pee and just let herself out. Oh, 
she's gonna eat cereal no we don't need to do that go home you cooked mac and cheese all right so we're just gonna let ourselves out because he's being creepy with his eyes still open um but yeah first baby we love that i'm gonna have her go home and eat and then we're gonna have her join in on the military career once she's done that and we'll see where that gets us um by the way i did move like i said i moved and i'm now living in the city like literally in the middle of the city so if you hear any train noises or any like background city noises that is the reason it's extremely loud here um but i love it but yeah just keep that in mind i should have said that in the first part but i forgot i'm gonna have her eat and then go join the military career i have no idea of where that even is there she is gonna have her join the military career and that'll be her job and then she'll get some unpaid time off we love to see it get paid for being pregnant and hopefully hopefully it all works out for us you know and maybe record another part Ooh, why is it green outside literally the sky is green oh you know what i think i forgot i had a lighting mod in oh that was really cool seeing her just drive off like that um, i'm gonna bring this part to an end but like i said i'm gonna record the next part and maybe release one part each week that way i can give myself a good little bump a good little buffer for parts because if i don't do this now i'm gonna get really busy i'm going to fly for work um and i won't be able to do it i can take my like i record on my imac and then i edit on my macbook and i can take that along with me and just edit everything from there so that's the one good thing about having a <laughs> a desktop and a portable computer uh because oh. if if i only edited it for my imac i would not be able to get as many videos up as possible because because um i can't carry a 27 inch imac on my trips could you imagine in the military you'll have the chance to protect loved ones and possibly even travel to space as an astronaut you'll need to be in top physical condition and know how to fix a thing or two attention a soldier um she does have the handiness skill she doesn't have any athletic which is a little well, we should see how that goes i mean she'll probably end up going to the gym and stuff but her first day of work is wednesday at 7 a.m she does need to work on her athletic skills so maybe that's what she'll do all day tomorrow work on that athletic school skill and it does say her boss here is aaron kennedy which is her next door neighbor so we'll try to get to know her as well and we'll see how that goes for us. Um, but like I said, I'm probably, yeah, I'm gonna bring this part here to an end. She's just gonna head to sleep. And in the next part, we'll try to work on her skills, meet our boss, and hopefully she'll find out she's, hopefully she'll find out that she's expecting tomorrow. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this part. If you did, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. If you wanna let me know your thoughts or comments on this part or any other part or any, just wanna leave me some love, go ahead and comment that down below and I will see you guys in the next one.